Hello everyone. Today we study the Faraday's law of electricity numerical. This is a basic of electrochemistry. So let us start with it. We are having a problem. A current of 4 ampere is passed through a solution of silver nitrate for about 50 minutes. Calculate the weight of the silver which is deposited on a cathode. So here the given of the silver electrochemical equivalence is 1.118 into 10 raised to minus 3. Also in the problem current is 4 ampere and the time is 50 minutes. So here we are finding that the weight of silver deposited ok so first of all you have to write the given in that particular problem then in this particular case we are using the Faraday's law of electricity the Faraday's law of electricity is W is equal to Z into I into so, in this particular problem, the electrochemical equivalence is represented by Z, means this entity is called as Z entity. Then given Z is 1.118 into current given is, uh, sorry, 1.118 into 10 raised to minus 3 into current given is 4 and the time which is required to deposit that particular metal is 50 minutes. We have to calculate this. After calculating this particular equation, we are getting the answer 2 point, sorry, 223.6 into 10 raised to minus 3. Then we have to convert that particular entity is 0 0.223. So, we get the weight of the silver deposited in that particular problem is point 0 0.223 gram. So, this is a well known example which is based on Faraday's law of electricity. Let us begins with let us begins with the second problem. The second problem is calculate the electrochemical equivalence of the copper when same quantity of electricity is passed in series through solution containing copper sulfate and silver nitrate. The copper sulfate and silver nitrate deposited is 0.2355 gram and 0.8253 gram respectively on the respective ions or electrode. So, in this particular problem we are having a given that is nothing but the electrochemical equivalence of silver is 1.118 into 10 raised to 3 gram per ampere per second. We have to find out electrochemical equivalence of copper. The weight of the copper deposited on the respective electrode is 0.2355 gram and weight of the silver deposited is 0.8253 gram. So let us begin with the solution. Electrochemical equivalence of the silver is 1.11 8 into 10 raised to 3. It gives the 0.8253 gram deposition. Then we have to find out the electrochemical equivalence of copper. And at that particular equivalence, the expected quantity deposited is 0.2355 gram. So, student, in this particular case, we are using the cross multiplication for finding out the entity of electrochemical equivalence of the copper. So, see here, 
the electrochemical equivalence of the copper is finding out chemical equivalence of copper is equal to 1.118 into 10 raised to 3 into 0 0.2355 divided by 0 0.8253 after getting the cross multiplication and solvation of this particular equation we are getting the answer what is the answer for this particular case is so we are getting the answer point 3190 into 10 to 3. After converting this entity, we are getting the final electrochemical equivalence of the copper is 319. So, student, in this particular case, we are calculating the electrochemical equivalence of any metal. So, it is a second number problem in the first case we are using the faraday's law in the second case we are finding out the electrochemical equivalence so student the next problem is how long will it take for a current of 3 ampere to deposit 15 gram of copper from copper sulfate solution so in this particular problem we are having a given electrochemical equivalence of the copper is 3.290 into 10 raised to minus 4. The current required for the deposition is 3 ampere and the weight of the substance deposited during this particular process is 15 gram. So for this particular case how much time is required is calculated. So, here again we are using the Faraday's law W is equal to Z into I into T. So, let us put the value. Before putting the value, we have to convert this particular formula. We have to find the time. Therefore, Z into I divided by W. So, put the value of this, we are getting Z. The given Z is 3.290 into 10 raised to minus 4 into current given is 3 ampere divided by the weight of the substance deposited is 15. So, after calculating this particular equation, we are getting the answer. Point six five eight into ten raised to minus four. So the time required to deposit the fifteen gram of the copper on the respective electrode is point six five eight into ten raised to minus four seconds. Okay. So student, today we study the three types of problem. In the first problem, we study the Faraday's law of electricity. We are using the same formula W is equal to Z into I into T. Then in the second problem, we are finding out the electrochemical equivalence. If the two metal is present having the same quantity of electricity passed through the solution and again we are finding out the third pattern of the faraday's law of electricity here we are using the same formula but only the given term in this particular case is w z and i we are finding out the time required to deposit that the metal ion so student so for this particular case i am giving the same problem which is based on the same formula of the faraday's law for the homework so the problem for the homework is problem number one is if the current of 5 ampere is passed through 
silver nitrate solution for one hour calculate with the weight of the silver deposited on the cathode so for this purpose the given of the electrochemical equivalence of silver is 1.118 into 10 raised to minus c again you are using the same formula that is faraday's law of electricity w is equal to z into r into t here the hours one hour you should convert it into the minutes so next is next problem for the solution is calculate weight of silver deposited when current of 5.2 ampere is passed through silver nitrate solution for 1 hour and 8 minute again same formula of the faraday's law of electricity we are, you are going to use and for this purpose you have to first convert the 1 hour into the minutes the total minutes used for the deposition is 68 that is the hint for this for the solution of this problem the next and final problem you have to solve at home is how long will it take for current of 3 ampere to deposit 15 gram of copper from copper sulfate solution the given term is electrochemical equivalence of the copper is 3.290 into 10 raised to minus 4 again in this case we are you are using w is equal to z into i into t here the missing term is time okay so student if do you have any problem regarding this topic you can ask into the discussion forum thank you